A crowded field on the Republican side. Pittsburgh's Action News 4 reporter Bob Mayo speaks one on one with candidate Melissa Hart about why she wants your vote. Melissa Hart was a state senator in the 1990s, a member of Congress in the 2000s. After 15 years in private practice as an attorney, she's running for governor in the Republican primary. For all these years I've been in the private sector, I keep hearing from people how the state government is an impediment instead of a partner. Hart says she's worked a lot with small businesses. She's on the board of a bank that's a small business lender. If elected, she'd be Pennsylvania's first woman governor. And I'm the only candidate from Western Pennsylvania. I believe that I can deliver better for people. I can win as a Republican who always won in Democrat districts. It's important for someone to talk to people and work with people and quit the division. Uh, so that we can get things done. Asked her top issues, she starts with jobs and job training. We have concerns now with people out of the job market. It's important for us to create an environment where those openings are filled. Hard spotlights education. School choice, charter schools have been very successful. We need to help make more of them so that students can explore their talents earlier. She wants to lower the state's corporate net income tax and better connect Pennsylvania's energy industry to market. We need pipelines. There's been an impediment from state government to development and, and the construction of those pipelines. We need to complete those. Art wants to end no excuse voting by mail and drop boxes. I would like to repeal the act that instituted the early voting, the no excuse mail-in balloting and all those changes that were made before the 2020 election. Hart favors banning abortion, except to protect the life of the mother. Yeah, I'm pro-life. So I believe that from the time of conception, that's a separate entity, a separate child, separate human, okay? So I do want to defend life. With Commitment 2022 coverage, Bob Mayo, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.